So I decided to do some cleaning in my garage. And my garage is full of computer parts. And that's when I found this old Dell laptop. And after some careful research, I found this laptop was made in 2010. And because of its age, I have no use for this laptop. However, I do want to recycle this eventually. So before I recycle this laptop, I need to remove the hard drive. This Dell model is the Dell Vostro V13. So guys, today I'm going to show you how to open this up and remove the hard drive. The only tool you're going to need is a small Phillips head screwdriver. Let's go ahead and start by removing all the screws on the back. This Dell laptop has a few design flaws. For one, it has a non-replaceable battery, as well as RAM or hard drive. This Dell laptop does have a decent Windows performance and is solid and light and cheap. Okay, now that we've removed all the screws, we can begin to pry up the panel. Okay, here's the inside of the laptop. You can see the rechargeable battery. And top right is the hard drive. And there's the hard drive right there. So one of the major design flaws for this Dell laptop was the battery. It just would not hold a charge. The battery life was simply awful. I'm going to go ahead and remove the battery and then we'll remove the hard drive. And here's that terrible battery. So now we need to remove these two screws. They hold the hard drive in place. and the hard drive comes out easily. Next, we'll remove the hard drive from the case. And the case is connected with the four screws. And that's it guys, that's how to remove a hard drive from a laptop, a very old laptop. Now I can take the rest of the parts to my local recycle shop. And remember, always remove your hard drive before you recycle your laptop. You don't want anybody stealing your data or personal information. Well guys, we're all done here. And as usual, I want to thank you guys for watching. And remember, if you like these videos, give a thumbs up and share it. If you love it, hit subscribe to keep this channel alive.